Jangan ngasih pok ya Okay, so I believe uh, a fair few of you probably don't want to see this video, but are probably looking to actually find out the reasons to why I quit. Now, I did read, I pretty much I got home from school like 20 minutes, well, like, yeah, about 30 minutes ago or something. I've just been reading comments on YouTube and stuff. I didn't reply to any because there was so many that if I replied to some and not others, it would have seemed like a bit disrespectful. But I did read pretty much every single comment on my... Um, the video I uploaded yesterday, I know there was actually a lot of comments that were saying that I was only... Oh my god, go away, Danny. There was actually a lot of comments on my video that were saying things like that. I'm only quitting for two weeks. I'm not quitting for two weeks, let's just say that. Uh, the reason that I put that there is because normally when a video maker uploads a video saying I'm quitting, they come back in two weeks saying they are back to the game. For all I know, that may happen to me. I don't know. I will talk about what will probably bring me back to the game in this video, but yeah, that's another one. There's another thing that said it's something to do with like extents or something. I have a clue, but they're going over like, oh, bro, he smacked 69 hill fatalities. I don't have a clue what that was about. That was making me laugh so hard. It's like a two, three pages of spamming and some of them were top rated comment run. Blah, blah, blah. I don't even know what that was, but that's funny. But yeah, I read a lot of comments. I've also read a lot of YouTube PMs and stuff that are telling me like I shouldn't quit and all that. Personally, I mean, you're all telling me to not quit because I'm like a great commentator. The reason I'm quitting is because I hate the game. I don't, sorry, hate is a strong word. I dislike the game and how it runs at the moment. I've been disliking it for a long time. If you want to know how long that the game has been, like, not as enjoyable for me in the long run, is, is simply before I got a tackle, before I started my playing risky properly. I did all that stuff to hopefully make the game enjoyable. It didn't really work, so that kind of did suck. And I did say that if I did stop enjoying it completely, that I would just quit simply. But there's a few things that I'd like to say, first of all. So, uh, I'm going to start off with saying... I don't know, there's something I wanted to quickly say then, but I completely forgot what it was. But I'm going to go into this. I'm just going to tell you now. Um, I did say that I dislike the game, and I won't really be playing the game. But something I do like is commenting. I absolutely love commenting. As you can see, I've obviously got like a load of subscribers. I've got YouTube partners. I've done all this stuff simply from commenting. I don't know how many people actually subscribe to me for gameplay. There is a lot of you. I know that Like simply is going to be people commenting now that they subscribe for the game. But most of the time, the comments are all saying that they subscribe for commentary. Now... I don't believe I will be uploading videos of other games. I don't know. I may do, but I'm not going to do that without giving people a lot of warning and all that. Oh, interrupted and I forgot where I was. I believe I was talking about how I could, um, how I'm not going to be uploading other games yet. I, pr I'm, I mean, I don't know if I'm going to do that. I don't know what games I'm going to play. There's a load of games I could play. Like, I believe if there's any game I'm going to start playing now, it's going to be League of Legends. I've not played it before, but I don't know if I could comment it because it's like a 40 minute game. So I really don't know if I'll ever do that. But just to say now, I probably won't be uploading any of the game videos. However, what I can do before I get into the main topic, I don't know if you would want this, preferably, I, but I mean, what I'm doing right now is just recording the RuneScape screen and talking to you. Now, if I recorded a black screen, I think the video would be a lot different and wouldn't be as enjoyable. Like, I'm not doing nothing at the moment, but I'm sure most of you are watching this video and are still listening. Now, I could upload videos like this all the time. I have absolutely no problem with commentating. I love commentating, but I don't like playing the game. However, I can commentate without playing the game. I don't need the game. Like, I can commentate playing the game. So what's going to stop me commentating not playing the game? Now I can get topics and all that. I mean, I can just do suggested topics. I can talk a bit about updates. Like today was Botany Bay and I've been told bots are already back. Now I don't know how that's going to work. I've not logged on. I don't really plan on logging on. I was going to actually plan on logging on and walking around and stuff, but I don't really need to because I believe this is just the same. But yeah, I can probably commentate pretty much what I want to do. I mean, I can find out what people would want me to talk about. And I can probably get some good videos up there. I mean, Overall, just putting myself in the situation that I'm at at the moment, I have 31,000 subscribers on YouTube and I had a ton of comments that were saying things like that they didn't want me to quit and all that. And when I say that, I mean there was a lot of them. There's a load of, there's some load of negative, negative comments as well, but I don't really mind about that much. I mean, there's just like, you know, that happens. When a video maker uploads a quitting video, you get a lot of negative comments as well. But I don't really mind about those. It's the positive ones that I actually care about. But I mean, just to say that, I think on some level, I should show you the respect simply because you're all here to, well, some of you have been subscribed here for a very long time. Let's just say that. And why am I, should be, why should I be the one to leave you all here? I think just on the base, what is it? I don't know the word, the base moral of respect that I should actually upload some videos every now and then for you to actually enjoy. I mean, if we put this like, I've quit RuneScape, but I've still got the YouTube channel. I mean, I don't have to quit YouTube, but I don't really want to be doing it 
making RuneScape videos. And I know a lot of you aren't going to like that, but I, I can upload a video just like this, but obviously on more positive topics, talking about enjoyable stuff. But I think if I did that, a lot of people would hope that I would come back to playing the game, which I'm just going to, I'm just going to leave it as that. If you would want me to upload videos like this, like just talking to the screen, I, this RuneScape screen is not to be, I could record anything in the background, but I don't really plan on logging on. I could probably log on another account, but I don't really want to log on my own at the moment because I'll get a load of PM straight away. But yeah, if you want me to do that, leave a comment, and then obviously I'm gonna try. I try read to all the comments. I can't really reply to them because I mean, I reply to like the first hundred, then I go to sleep. I come back and I've got eight hundred. I can't reply to seven hundred comments. I mean, I don't reply to every comment. I reply to like one in every ten, twenty. But that video had a lot more than that, so I mean, I would have had to reply to about two hundred comments on that video, like with like properly typed out. So I don't really have the time to reply to. But I do read them all. So if there's a lot of people that would want me to upload videos like this, still leave a comment. No problem by me. I love commenting. Just put it there. I'm not going to be like, don't put a comment saying that it wouldn't be as enjoyable to watch you make a video of something I don't enjoy. I love commenting. No problem at all when I make commentary videos. But yeah, as I'm playing the game, not happening anytime soon. Which is going to bring me on to the topic of what's actually going to bring me back. Now, if you are here once again with my rambles where I say the title of the video is why I've quit, pretty much what will bring me back to... Actually, you know what? I'm going to dedicate that to a different video. That at least gives me another video for you to actually look forward to. But I could probably elaborate more on everything and then make it a longer video and something more enjoyable. So yeah, I will leave that to another video. But yeah, main reason I quit. So first things first, uh, I saw a lot of comments on my other video saying that certain people were the reason I quit the game. That's not true. There is no individual in this game that I has caused me to quit. That isn't even the reason I've quit. The community, you will have known me for this, but they don't annoy me at all. I get ragged constantly, doesn't annoy me. I get PJ'd a lot, doesn't annoy me. On some level, it's kind of frustrating, but overall, it doesn't get annoying. Stuff like that. I can deal with that on some level. Like when it happens like 10 times, like the video I loaded where it was called like PK and Rescape 2012, that all happened in a I think it was one hour and 20 minutes, and I recorded every single fight and put every single fight in there. So you can understand how many proper fights I had against how many non-proper fights I had, and then the times period. That is something that I can't stand. That is a reason that I don't play a game. I can't... I don't like non-fast basic. Now, as for me, if people ask me to fight, I say no to a lot of fights, because there are simply people I don't want to fight. And then they turn into haters straight away, because they can't accept a no. Now, if I'm putting a video out saying that I don't get enough fights, and that's the reason I quit, then they're going to be like... Yeah, but you say no to every fight. Now, that's true, kind of, but I, I kind of want to fight people. I want, like, I'm not going to fight someone who has, like, as an example here, as a person I don't fight, who has a magic short bow to an armadillo god sword, and I'm in 200 ping, which is as soon as I see his god sword, I can't survive. So because if I click my rock tail, he's going to hit me before it heals me. I die every time. Waste of supplies. No fun fighting him. No point. I'm going to say no. Rangers, I say no. Now, a fight is a fight. I will fight a lot of people out there, but people like that, rangers especially, can't stand him. I don't enjoy fighting rangers at all. That's not really the main reason I've quit. I believe the if you want the sole reason of why I'm actually quitting, it has to be the lack of good updates and the lack of good updates to come. I see this game as many people are currently playing the game hoping an update is going to come out in the future that will be will turn the game and make it good. And in my opinion, that's never going to come. It's going to be a very long time, in my opinion, for that to come. Every update that comes now is Solomon really. All this cosmetic stuff is ridiculous. It is not part of this game, in my opinion. It's just... It is... Com that, I think those, like, I know everyone says that that's the reason, but I think those have destroyed the game on some level. They really have, like, you may not think it's that much, like, you may say the microtransactions are ruining the game. They're not, because the cosmetics, but on the same level, yes, it's completely destroying the game, in my opinion. The fact that it's not destroying the game, but it's kind of destroying the Jagged staff members, and all they care about now is just bringing more of these cosmetics in. No one cares if you spend a week making a cosmetic. Seriously. Why not put that week towards making the Crucible the best content that could possibly... Co I'll probably talk about this in the video tomorrow, but if you made the Crucible single combat and no familiars and simply exactly how it is now, maybe with a much better target system, it would be the best content on the game. Why can they not see that? I don't understand. Seriously, I... I am not a Jagged Staff member. I have played this game for a long time. I know exactly what people would enjoy. Why can't they? That is something I really cannot see. Now, I know there's a lot of comments that are saying, like, why don't they do the EOC? The majority of people who haven't played the EOC, I mean, who haven't played the EOC are saying they don't want it. I personally have not played the EOC. The EOC is not the reason I'm quitting. It's not even here yet. Why would it cause me to quit? Why would I quit two months in advance to something that's coming out? I, in my opinion, when the EOC comes out, I'll definitely play it just to try it out. And if it sucks, I'm gone straight away. But if it's enjoyable, maybe I'll play the game again. I, I would love, I, I know I uploaded this and I'm quitting, but I would love to come back to the game. Simply because, I mean, 
I have so much behind me that would, I mean, I'd love to get motivated again, but I don't have the motivation to play the game, so there's no point in me playing it at all. But I would love to, I've quit the game, this is my, if you read the description, this is my fourth time quitting, like, properly. I've come back three times, technically, which means I can always come back a fourth time. Now, please don't keep your hopes up for that, because obviously, times change, life for me is currently different and all that, and then there's different things that come around, and just stuff like you have to kind of see it, but I mean, if the... Like I say, when I upload the video saying what's going to make me come back, which I don't know when I'll upload that, I'll probably get that one out tomorrow. I've got another in real life video that should be coming out soon. Like, um, if your friend doesn't know, I'll keep it a secret actually. It's going to be kind of enjoyable to do because it's going to be all fun and surprises for me as well as you because uh, and uh, only one person is going to know what I'm talking about here. Maybe a few of them maybe to talk about. But yeah, I mean, the main reason I've quit this game, and I'm sure a lot of you can agree with me, but maybe aren't taking it that like badly as quitting the game. But I mean, I, if you want, like I put, I've played the game for 10 years. I have PK'd, I have played through every single era of this game. I don't know if I pronounced that right. But it's at this point where I just don't see any more positive things coming out to play. I've played everything down to like, I've played everything pretty much, just see it this way. I've played every part of content in this game so much that there's nothing enjoyable anymore. And the only new stuff that comes is dead content within the day or just Solomon stuff that is not needed and just doesn't have to be in the game. And yeah, I know a lot of people just, I know this is all the basic stuff that everyone talks about, but yeah, that is simply the reason that it's just, I don't know, there's nothing enjoyable to do. And I may actually, I don't know about this, this may not be a thing, but I may actually go for 200 more Dungeoneering. Dungeoneering with friends is actually really fun on the game. Like you may think Dungeoneering is the worst skill. If you dungeon with five, four friends, sorry, it's really fun. So I may do that because I would enjoy logging on the game to Dungeoneer. Simple as that, it's an aspect of the game that I like. Dungeoneering videos, not coming, just say just to say it. But yeah, there is, uh, there's more aspects on top of that that have made me quit. Like, for those who are going to say, like, did, did um, training my attack make me quit? Did playing runescape get properly uh, make me quit? Like I said, I did that to simply see if I could find more fun in the game, and it didn't really happen. Now, as for attack, I watched a video by Eco, a, a, like, I think it was the day before I quit, and he had 60 attack still, and he was busting, he was hitting so well. And I don't know if that is, like, making me want to get 60 attack. It would, I'd love to get 60 attack again, simply just to make a video like that. But, I mean, I have no complaints with the attack I had. It brought out a lot in the game and made a lot more enjoyable but now it's just like everything has been done and nothing is fun anymore that it's just in that situation but i mean going back to that as do i regret attack i don't really regret it i did it just to try and see if i get more fun out of the game and it didn't work so i guess in that aspect i kind of do regret it simply because it didn't work but i i really don't know what to say but yeah there isn't actually they are the main reason i've quit i mean things like attack and all that that haven't that hasn't made me quit but yeah i mean just stuff like that i don't really know what to say so i might as well end this video sometime soon so i'm not rumbling too long but yeah i think um just to try to sum this up the main reason i'm quitting the game is simply how i don't see any good updates to come in the future all i see is the evolution of combat combat coming out no matter what they bring out now in two months three months whenever the uc comes it's gone i mean i don't know I will probably log on to try some updates, like, I'm not, like, I still have my love for the game on some level, like, I will always have my love for this game, like, in three years' time, even if I don't play the game, I'll probably log on just to see what it's like, simply because I know what the game is, I've played it for so long that I want to log on, but, so that means if they actually bring out an interesting update that I like the sound of, like, Botany Bay and some quests came out today, I can't bother with that, it's garbage, but, I mean, if they bring back the PJ timer, possibly something like that, maybe I'll go try PK, and I highly doubt it'll be any different to how it is now, like, I don't get PJ'd much in fights, and, I mean, yeah, overall, I don't get PJ much of it. I do die to PJs occasionally. It does happen, but overall, that isn't the hugest issue to me. So the PJ time probably won't make me enjoy the game more. But we'll have to see what happens. Let's just say that. Hopefully, they'll update the Crucible. If they upgrade, if they update the Crucible to single combat, I believe I'll be there forever. As long as it's busy and it's actually quick fights and all. I'll probably be in the Crucible all the time. I really do not know what to say but yeah this is probably going to be my only video today i'm going to upload this hopefully today date is the 3rd of august 2011 but if i get this up i'll be able to answer a fair few questions well some pe well, some comments and all that but i don't know if i'll be like i'm not at my computer anymore like this is something strange here like, i'll keep this really short but i've spent a lot of time playing this game and to suddenly not be putting any more time into it i have a lot of free time that i'm gonna have to try and find something to do so yeah i have to get around to that but oh well anyways that's been this video guys so Pretty much, just to, if you want anything to leave this video with, obviously um, you can leave the comments that I asked for, but put it this way, I have quit RuneScape, but I've not quit YouTube. I'll always be on YouTube. For, the, for those that aren't like interested in the RuneScape gameplay or are more into me for my commentary or just simply who I am and all that, which a lot of people are, and it really is, it really does mean a lot that some people are here for that, then yeah, I will be here. For those for RuneScape gameplay, pretty much, I don't know if I should say unsubscribe, because I don't know if I'll be coming back, but... 
I've quit three times before I may come back, let's just say that. Normally every video maker does come back, but yeah, I mean, it is sad to say, like, I saw a lot of comments saying that another great video maker is, um, has quit, and yeah, I have to say, there's so many video makers that are just quitting, like, who's going to be next? Like, I'm quitting now, for all I know, someone else is going to quit, like, I think I, uh, Suomi uploaded a video, yeah, Suomi did upload a video on the day saying that he was going to be taking a break from the game, simply because, same reasons as me, I mean, another huge reason that I, yeah, this is probably a bigger reason to the other ones, though, why I'm probably quitting this game, is probably griefing, and how one person can do whatever they like on this game, no matter what it does to other people, and they can't do anything about it. Nothing at all. If they had a report abuse for griefing or something like that, then it should be, I don't know, it should be, it'd be impossible to track, but, I mean, let's just say, put it in this perspective, one person can go out in the wilderness with, let's say, Storm of Armadillo at 95 combat and clear every single 95 combat PK there. Nothing can be done about it except that they have to leave PK. I find that ridiculous, and it shouldn't actually be part of this game. Let's just convert this. Let's just compare this to Call of Duty. Call of Duty, I'm in a lobby. Someone's chopping with a right shield. I leave the lobby. I join a new lobby. He's no longer there. Sorted. RuneScape. Someone's Storm of Armour dealing me. I leave the wilderness. I come back. He's Storm of Armour deals me. Continues permanently, and he's always there. One person can always be that, and that is something that really does need to change on this game, in my opinion. The fact that people can do that. They, they are willing to go out of their way to annoy people. Simple as that. That's just it. They can they, they can do it as well. There's nothing you can do about it. If someone is ragging you while you're hybriding, what can you do about it? Well, options. You can kill him, or you can leave, or you can hope he gets off. Most likely, will you kill him? Depending on the gear, raggers are fairly easy to kill, because they have no idea. Well, some of them know how to speak gear, but the majority of them are just no clueless to PK in really. Um, other ones, leave. Yes, you can leave, but then you get bored. Simple as that. And then obviously you can hope to get off you. In these days, it rarely happens. Seriously, I don't know how bad ragging is. Like I have a lot. Of, I know a lot of people who are out there to rag people, but they don't attack me because they like my videos. And I also have people who like my videos who do attack me. I don't understand that part. And then of course I have the people who don't like my videos and will go out of their way to rag me just to annoy me. Those I don't care about because they make me laugh. Simple as that. But that. Really, in my opinion, griefing on this game does need to be fixed, and that one needs to be fixed fast because that is the reason that this game. Like, not I'm not even trying to say that the community is bad here. Like, that's not the point of this. It's the fact that they can be that way. If they couldn't be that way, would the community be bad? Simple as that. Let's just say Jagat's updated the system so that if you, I mean, let's put it this way: if you could put someone on your ignore list and it would remove them from the game and they would not be able to interact with you in any way, and anything they did would not interact with you, then maybe obviously there'd be a lot of flaws, like they could just attack your fight, and then obviously something strange is going to happen in that situation, but if they did that, then in my opinion that would be a really good update. But yeah, like I said, um, it's not the community, it's just, the community is the way it is, in my opinion, because they can do it. There's nothing that stops them doing it, so they can choose to do it, and they will do it. If they couldn't do it, they wouldn't do it. And that is as simple as that. So I'm going to end the video there. So I do hope you enjoyed this one. I know it's another downhill commentary, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, I did. I definitely owed you this video just to tell you that I'm quitting. For those, I do hugely apologize for those that were thinking that I was quitting for two weeks. But like I said, for all I know, I'll be back in two weeks. I don't know. But yeah, just consider. I don't know if I'll be logging in. But yeah, if you want to see videos from me at all, like, I'm not going to quit on YouTube. But I probably will slow down a lot. And I may actually quit YouTube. I don't know. I mean, if I don't really want to do anything. I don't want to go out of my way to replace some of the games and make, like, I don't know. If I find a new game I enjoy and everyone else enjoys me commentating, I think I can commentate anything. So, so I reckon I can commentate any game. Like, some people say I could commentate watching paint dry. Uh, I don't know if I could do that, but I think I can commentate almost any game out here. As long as I can get into it, which unfortunately for this game, no longer. But I mean, I can get into other things, but there's a lot of mainstream games that I'd love to find a non-mainstream game and play that, but I don't know. So that's about it for this video, guys. So thank you for listening, and I will... I don't know when I'll see you soon, actually. Um, I really do not know. But if I do, to, if let's just say, if I do decide to stop making YouTube videos, I will tell you all. Simple as that. But yeah, thank you for watching.